Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, it is November 1st. That just clicked into my head. Wow. First day of November, which means my birthday is in 25 days. What? Oh, uh, yeah. Anyways, today I am doing another vlog because this has been a long awaited thing on my wish list. Not really that long, like a um, month and a half or so, something like that. Anyways, today I am going to Ikea to get my brand new desk. You could probably tell by the title or the thumbnail. But yeah, I am so excited. I will show you guys the desk I have currently. So I actually have a full video on my YouTube channel already of my desk and I'll put that right here if you guys are interested to go watch that. And you're probably looking at it like, Maya, it's perfectly fine. Like desk, you know, yes, I totally understand, I know. And I honestly haven't had this desk for that long, like maybe a year and a half now. So the main reason I wanted to get a new desk in the first place was because this just isn't working anymore. Because I have my laptop now, it is huge and it takes up the whole space on my desk. So that is why I'm currently using this little table that I put on the side. It's not very stable, the table. So I put it there and I put my laptop there so then I can write while I'm on my desk. And also for space wise, I have so much junk junk kind of not really junk but in the corner of my room and it needs to get put away but i don't have space so the desk that i have in mind to get i'll put an image on the screen here there are so many drawers in that that is going to be amazing that desk is very big compared to the desk i have now but i'm actually going to show you how it's going to fit in my room because me and my dad measured it out so the desk i'm planning on getting is going to go from here to that wall. So it's gonna take up with this, which is actually perfect because all the stuff in these drawers, like my camera equipment, scrapbooking stuff, it is all gonna go in my new desk. It's gonna be so nice because my room is gonna be so much cleaner and I am just so excited. And along with my desk, I wasn't even thinking about this. But I'm also gonna be getting a new chair for my desk. Uh, this is the chair I currently have. And personally, I'm fine with it. Like, I, I can work with it, but it is actually uh quite old like very old and the cushion is all like worn out like it is not soft at all this chair is very ugly. like i'll just show you that this isn't squishy it's not squishy it's just hard and uh it hurts my bony butts so I'm very excited to be getting a new chair too because especially this past week, I've been spending so much time just sitting in my chair doing work. And um, also that is why by the time this is uploaded, which I actually don't know when this will be uploaded, but it has just been so hard for me to upload when I want because I just get jam packed with assignments. Like currently I'm writing an essay and a report for civics and just, really don't have time like both of those together no no since i spend so much time here i can't wait to have a brand new desk it's going to change my environment and it's also going to change my room especially the appearance where my metals are because it's going to be way more open here and i'm planning on getting like a corner shelf to put my trophies so much at once i know point is it is 909 and um i have to leave by 9 30 so i need to get ready and we are heading over to ikea So to cut things short, IKEA was literally a disaster, but we managed to pull through and get everything that we needed, even though we literally thought everything was sold out, but it was right at the front when we first entered. So yeah, we got everything and then we were off to Staples. <music> Hey guys, so we just got back home. It is 12.45 and we were there for three hours. So we went to Ikea, got the desk, and then the plan was to also get myself a new chair, even though like, it's not like 
mandatory on my list you know but it would be nice to get a new chair because this one like i said it's just very um hard but i'm honestly used to it but i'm so tired i just want to go to sleep i don't know when we're gonna start putting it together well my dad's gonna do all the putting together stuff but the plan is i'm gonna make my bed and then we're gonna put all my desk stuff like it'll be on my bed and then we will start putting the desk here and i'll start organizing it but i really need to finish my schoolwork. but it just takes like like you can't rush what i'm doing i'm doing an essay and i'm doing a report so anyways gonna start working on that even though i just got home and i really just want to try and finish it i have to finish my essay it's due tonight actually at 11 59 p.m so lovely Hey guys, so welcome back. It is so much later now. Currently 5.30 p.m. So it has been a really long day of putting this desk together and kind of getting stuff organized, even though it's really not organized yet. Like my room is still a bomb. Uh, I am actually very happy because that today is November 1st. The clock went back an hour. So I have had a lot more time today, which is amazing. But I have so much to do still. Like, I still have to finish my essay. Um, yeah, one of my assignments, I'm just going to have to hand that in late. But my teacher actually doesn't take marks off for it being in late, which is amazing. And I'm going to try and finish cleaning my desk space because it's such a bomb. Um, yeah. I just ate because I haven't eaten since breakfast. And y'all, I, I like to eat food. Food's my friend. So, I was like shaking. I was so hungry. So this is currently what I am working with. So we have our desk. It is huge. Like, it is actually bigger than I thought. Like, it, my desk used to be from here to here. Now it is from here to here. Boom. So big. Anyway, so yeah, we're working with here. I just ate my foods here, brought some stuff, my homework stuff, whatever. I'm getting rid of this or I might be putting it in my closet. Same with that. A lot of the papers here are going to be going in that drawer. Uh, yeah, more of that stuff going in these drawers. And then my carpet, I folded it because I actually need to push it more against my bed now. The wire box will be going under here. And yeah, most of that stuff, it has a plan. And peep that monster hide all. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that's currently the situation. I am going to get back to cleaning now. Hi 
Hi guys and welcome back. It is the next day. Today is November 2nd, 2020 and this is what my desk currently looks like. It is kind of a bomb and I actually have my next class in 20 minutes. So I am going to clean it up and kind of give you guys a tour of what's happening. I think the most obvious thing is this pink blotch um, on the wall because that was the old color of my wall which I do have a video of when I redid my room and painted it so if you guys are interested in that it'll be up here but uh definitely want to paint this I've been loving my desk also yesterday I was complaining about my essay yes well guess what I finished it at 10 09 p.m I'm very relieved but I actually am behind in another assignment so that's fun um but yeah so I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour of my desk, clean it up, and I'll get to my class. Alrighty, so this is what we are working with right now. I'll just start with the drawers, come back up, go this way, and then go to that drawer. So first drawer, and also it's not perfect yet, but we're just working with what we're thinking. So this first drawer is gonna be the one that I use a lot, because my main stuff is gonna be in here. So I have like this journal, I don't use it all the time, so I put it in the back. I have this planner I put in here, a ruler, and then this placemat if I want to eat on my desk but I don't want to get it dirty. And this journal actually also goes in here. The next drawer are just uh, wires I use a lot. Cable stuff for YouTube and other stuff. In this next one, I have uh, some scrunchies and my Vaseline. <laughs> I put all my sticker books here. Uh, these are like scrap pieces of scrapbook that I can like still use in this bucket. And then these are old journals with a picture of my Nana here. In this next one, it's pretty random. It's just old books and journals. Uh, not really old, but yeah, just ones that I don't really use anymore. Some of my DVDs and then books that I can read when I'm in the mood to read. And in this last drawer, I keep all my camera equipment and I even have my DVD player back here when I like to watch old movies. But yeah, it fits perfectly and I just love it. Now we're going all the way back to the top surface of the desk. So first we have this candle here. It's almost burned out. It smells so good. Then I have my trophies here. I'm planning on putting them on a shelf, uh, but for now, they will stay here on my desk and look superior. Then right here I got my storage with all like my stationary stuff and other goodies. I have another candle here, also smells really nice. Oh, well it's Apple, the sticker's off. And look at this, looks like a face. I don't know if that was purposely done or what. Anyways, we have a bottle cap which is going in the garbage. Uh, one of my pens, pasta that I just made my water um this is a mess just papers in my wallet a bunch of books that's you know like i said it's a mess my lamp um i just put my jewelry thing up here for now so my necklaces can hang properly i have all my markers here some hand sanitizer sticky notes picture of me and my parents this monster hide all is just hanging out here okay then i have my perfume a diffuser and then a bunch of hair elastics normally go in here now let's move on to this drawer. Oh yes, also if you look under my desk, this is temporarily here. I was trying to clean my room really quickly last night so I had a bunch of time to work on my essay. But anyways, first drawer, I have my paper cutter. This drawer still needs to be figured out but I will do so when I get a chance. This one is all my scrapbooking stuff like Fun fact, if you love scrapbooking, um, like I use this old Monster High book that I had when I was younger, because if you can tell, Monster High was my childhood um, toy. But anyways, what you do is you just rip pages out and you can use it for scrapbooking. It's actually really neat and a creative idea. This one is other scrapbook paper I have, but it's just too big that I can't really put it anywhere else. So I just put it in this drawer. This one's a mess. These are all my wires for my tripods and lights. Need to go through this, but again, I was in a rush. And in this last one, it is just 
all of my school kind of stuff so like notebooks if I need one binder file folder calculator papers so yeah I could not be happier with my new desk and I am just so grateful that my parents could get me this new desk because I really wanted one because like I said I was having trouble spacing stuff on my previous desk because my laptop is giant and I can't write at the same time so I'd always like be hunching on my back writing on my chair it was just not that great but I'm just so happy I got my new desk it like makes me excited to go sit down and do my work if I need to which most of the time I do need to because I got so much work but yeah this is my desk how it currently looks and yeah okay I will see you guys later